I heard a lot of people ask. Well, first off, I heard a lot of people write in what they know. 3x plus 10, 6x plus 8, which is definitely the first step whenever you do a problem like this. Don't just rely on reading the information, looking at the diagram, and, and de relying on your mind to connect the two. Put the information into the diagram. Visually see those, uh, those relationships. Now, I heard a lot of people ask, can we assume that this is 90 degrees? What's the answer to that? No, you can never assume it's 90 degrees. But we can conclude. The difference between assuming and concluding are very different. We're not assuming anything by saying this is 90 degrees. We're going based off of what they gave us. We're making a conclusion based on the given information. So we're not assuming it, but we can use that information because they actually told us. So 3x plus 10 plus 6x plus 8 equals 90. Now what does x equal? 8. Eight, which means that this is 34 degrees and this is 56 degrees. Now AS bisects RAT so we know that it divides into two congruent angles. Mm -hmm. So these are both what? 56 degrees. So is angle 2 congruent to angle 3? Or uh, four rather. Yes. yes. How do we know that they're congruent? Yeah? If two measures have, sorry, two angles, you said, two angles have same measure, then they are congruent. Go ahead, write down your big idea for this one.